You guys see where we're at. Finale's like, oh yeah, my favorite store. Peko and Delilah is going to probably touch everything and rack this bill up. As you can see, Finale's very excited. And we are about to put the car in park and talk about it for a little bit for you guys. So I'm here with my best friend, Dara, and my two daughters, Benelli, and I'll let Dara pick up the Lila. Little D. So we are going to take them into Petsmart, or Petco. And where the pets go. Pet, oh, Petco, where the pets go. Okay, turn the AC down. And we're gonna let them walk around and whatever they touch. I'm probably gonna regret this because I went to a very cheap store. <laughs> But I'm gonna let them touch whatever they want, and whatever they do touch, we are taking it home with us. How exciting. They're like, woo! Okay, so let's go into the store, guys. Let's go, girls. Shoppy spree, shoppy spree, shop, shop, shoppy spree. Bye. Come on, babies. Let's go. Look how happy she is. We're doing so happy. So start with this one. All right, girls, let's go. Is that all? Oh, this one. You want this too? She loves. She has really cute face. Okay. Which one? <laughs> Another. Dilly touched the blue. No, she did not. Yeah, I she did. did. This is aisle one. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. So we realized that obviously walking with the buggy was not the smartest thing. So I'm just going to let the dogs walk through here. And, oh, Delilah. Look at these ones. This is a good, this is a good pick. Benelli, come back this way. Buggy. Do you want to be Of each. The dog that touches everything. She literally touches everything. Good behind you. <laughs> oh, oh, another one? We just got this in Chloe out the day. Look how cute. Oh my god, Bedelli, this is like Christmas for you. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Delilah. Delilah clearly doesn't like to shop. It's all about her sister shopping. Do you want any more toys? Yeah, of course you do. Holy crap. Guys, 
guys, I think we're literally going to buggy up. All right. How about we do some chew toys for your sister? We're gonna go. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it literally is the most expensive dog ever. <laughs> I think I touched everything down this aisle. Can we go like this one instead of that one? Here. A $20 costume. How much? A $20 costume. <laughs> no, but we already have one of those. <laughs> We're not going to put that one. These are like, they look dirty. But they come with two. Really? <laughs> like, what are you gonna do with this? I mean, I have to get it because it's the only thing she touched in here, right? So, one thing I do know we need is this. Vanilla's breakfast. Delilah, you ready to go shopping again? Come on. Right. Let's go. and let Delilah run the show for a little while because you know Benelli's filling up the top part of the buggy. So it's Delilah's turn to fill up the bottom part, right? Can we do this? Let's go. Let's go. These are your favorite treats. Look. Let's get something that we actually need. Look, you want to see? Kitty letter? Kitty. Seriously? You see? Touch him. Oh, we touched him. What do you think over here? Look. Do you see this guy? She's still learning. She's like, doesn't have her sister's expensive face just yet, <laughs> which I'm totally fine with. We're gonna walk down this aisle again with Delilah. Dee, you want any of this stuff? Come on, babe. is that we are going to take some of these dog toys and bring them to the shelter and donate them so dogs that are looking to be adopted can have some toys um, and live the life that you know, like kind of really like very selfish you know wants all the toys so we're gonna share the love because it's the holiday season and we're gonna bring some toys to the dog shelter we gotta give some credit to Dara because Dara works with local shelters and rescues and fosters believe it or not she actually brought a puppy up here to visit me this weekend and one of my other best friends Angelica is adopting a puppy so how exciting is that I'll do a video on him because it's really cute a wonderful story but Dara if you have any advice or anything that you like to put out there for people 
Um, I would really just say if you can help out your local shelter, rescue, anything in your community to do anything to help the animals, um, trust me, they greatly appreciate it. A lot of them don't have anything this time of year and most of them are waiting on homes. So please, if you can, donate some toys that you get from Petco as well. And that's water. Delilah's drinking. It's their water cup I bring around with them. Delilah literally is obsessed with it and any kind of water. But, um... I got this receipt. We are headed to the local dog shelter to donate some toys. Do you like your water cup? She's like, this is mine, mom. We know, Delilah, we know it's all yours. Hey guys, so we're here at the Humane Society. They are closed right now because it's a Sunday, but me and Dara are gonna go through the toys and pick out what toys we think are best and we'll hold up and we're gonna leave a little note that we're gonna show you guys. Um, and we'll show you guys the toys that we picked for them and go through it. Uh, but thanks to Benelli, all these dogs are getting these toys, right? You said you did so good, mama. And you guys can see Delilah in the back. She's passed out. She's on puppy time. Always sleeping during the day, but not at night. Um, but yeah, let's get it started. My trunk is a bit messy because I'm a dog mom. <laughs> and a horse mom. And a goat mom. <laughs> and a farm mom. But um, all right, so let's go. We obviously need the dog food for our dog, um, Benelli, that we bought for her because she's very picky with that. And these toys, um, I think this would be a good toy for a humane society, right? Yeah. Just because it has like the bone, the, it's an the antler, antler and, a, and a rope. It's good so for a big dog. Good for a big one. We'll leave, um, we do these treats. They're pretty yeah. big. We'll go in these treats because they're uh, a little bigger than my dogs need. Um, we'll do this. We have two of these toys, so we will give the... The Humane Society, this one. The pig. The pig, because it's a little bit harder. Mm -hmm. um, I know the rope. Look at Benelli. Oh my gosh. Y'all have to check this out. <laughs> Look. She's like, what? My rope? Um, we're going to give the dogs this rope because this is very sturdy and it will hold up. And I'm sure the doggies will love it. We're definitely going to give the, the dogs this bone because my little girls, this is about the size of them <laughs> combined. Um, and as well as this, I feel like this will hold up pretty well for the dogs and they'll really enjoy it. So we're about two bags deep. Um, Don't forget the monster. So I know this is <laughs> Delilah's favorite and it's about the size of my body. Um, but my dogs, I don't know what they're going to do with it. They're going to look at it and probably just lick it. So we're going to hand this over to them as well. And then what other toys? If we have two of these, we'll keep one for the girls. We'll get this one for them because this is a little bit, feel it. Like yeah. rope in there and stuff and everything. And we definitely don't need all these balls, so we're gonna separate some of them. We'll take two home for the girls and give them four of them. And then little toys are the girls. I think this is. And then I think we should give one to them. Which one do you think? We'll give them the rope one. Yeah, give right? them the rope one. Because this is pretty good for them, you think? Yeah. We have the box loaded up, packaged. Um, I'm in the car with the dogs. Dara is writing the little letter to everyone. I'm going to show you guys what it says for the Humane Society and all the dogs. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited and I hope these dogs enjoy these toys. Um, it'd be selfish of my dogs and me to keep all these toys to ourselves because other dogs that don't have owners um, and are waiting to find homes are going to now have new toys and stuff. And yeah, it's such a good deed. Um, so I'm very proud of you. Little now, good taste, baby. I kind of want them to distribute the toys to the longest residents that they've had here first. Um, I feel like they probably need a little more holiday spirit than the rest of us while I'm about to cry. <laughs> um. Aww. So do you want to read what you're writing so far? I wrote, please distribute these toys to your longest term residents first. Happy holidays. And we hope this will bring the animals a little bit of joy while waiting for their forever homes. Yes. And give us our contact, give them our contact information. And we're going to tell them that they can contact us and if they would like us to come out here. And I have the chill bumps. Um, make a video. And if they need help with fostering, we are always here to help. But Nelly, Delilah, girls, um, this isn't about you right now but we are going to give them our contact information so they can contact us. And believe it or not, we walked over, well, when we pulled up, we saw like a little bag here. So it looks like someone else has given them um, some toys and we just, you know, are trying to get back to the animals that are in need. We are about to drop off our 
our box of hoodies to the Humane Society. Okay. okay, I was just reading, it says over here for donating, but these are actually toys that we're donating to them. But here we go. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. All right, guys, so if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on that post notification bell so you guys are notified every time I upload a video. And don't forget to give back to your local shelters, volunteer, and anything helps, you know, there's a lot of animals out there that need homes. This video was not planned to turn out this way, but with my dog's spending tendencies and like to touch everything, we figured that we had too many toys to bring home and we decided to give them back to dogs that need toys and that don't have homes um, because it is the holiday season. But thanks guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it.